Now initially when I saw a 3-in-1 laser measuring device that has a laser measuring mode for roughly $23, I was thinking this is a lovely deal and I was really interested to compare it to my $200 Leica Disto that's just a laser measure. So my first impressions of the Measure King, it's huge, it's actually bigger than my analog tape measure, but funny enough it's actually lighter for some reason, quite a bit lighter. So on the top there is a little backlit screen that shows you the reading which is pretty good for accuracy and convenience. You can also choose what units you want to measure in and you can also choose whether or not you want to include the length of the device itself in the final measurement. So there are three ways you can measure using this thing two of which are actually really, really good. But unfortunately, the not so good one is the so-called laser distance measure, which is next to unusable. So let's talk about that for a second. I'll touch on the other two better measuring modes later on in the video. So although this was marketed as a laser distance measure, and it does actually shoot out a little laser for aiming, it actually measures using ultrasonic technology. And that is in contrast to my Leica Disto D2, which measures distance optically, which makes it much more accurate. So when you do get a reading off of the Measure King's laser mode, it's really not that accurate. I've had readings that were off by an entire foot compared to my Leica. Sometimes, although the laser does have a line of sight to the surface you want to measure, it can sometimes pick up a nearby surface in the foreground and that becomes your reading. Like, no way that wall I was pointing at was just a little over a foot away. It also has trouble pinpointing a reading on a smaller surface, such as a tree, although which I had my laser aimed on, it returned me with an error. So it was then I decided that the laser measuring mode really wasn't worth my time, so I guess it was time to check out the two other modes. So one of the really cool modes is a roller measure mode. So it measures as you roll, pretty self-explanatory. You can even roll backwards to take distance off. So it's great for measuring curved surfaces or whatever that's not in a straight line. And I found this mode and the next mode to be really quite accurate. So the next mode is really like your traditional tape measure mode, except it's a string. So you can use it like your conventional tape measure, but instead of having to struggle to read a scale, you can just glance at the screen, which flat out tells you what's your reading. But because it's a string, you can wrap it around things to measure circumference, and I also realized it makes for a pretty good waist measure. So that's pretty much all I have on the Measure King. I did think $23 for a laser distance measure was a bit too good to be true. I guess that's why people still buy these things. But if you pretend the laser measure function never existed and you use it for just the other two modes, it's actually a really neat gizmo. So I'll leave a link to this item in the description below for those of you who are interested. Hit me with any questions or comments you may have. And that's pretty much it for today, everybody. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.